So when it comes to streaming through OBS, if you're a PC gamer, you have a couple different options you can use. You got display capture and you got game capture. I'm not going to say that people don't know the difference in the two because display capture and game capture both go hand in hand. They pretty much do the same thing. It's more of people aren't sure which is better than the other. So in this video, we're going to go over display capture and game capture on OBS. Let's get into it. Welcome back to another installment on streamers blueprints. That's right. This is the third time we've changed the name. This is the third video and we're we're keeping this name now thanks to Justin he uh, ended up helping me decide on a solid name and I really like the vibe of streamers blueprints so let me know what you guys think of that down in the comments huge thanks to Justin for that but if you guys enjoy this video make sure you hit subscribe if you want to stay up to date with all of the new streamer blueprints videos I'm gonna be doing and pretty much everything else I'm gonna be doing um, definitely turn on those notifications and I hope to see you guys in some more videos and streams all right so I'm gonna turn my display capture off on uh, OBS so you guys don't see like all the streamception and everything but we're going to talk about display capture and game capture so if you are a pc gamer you are most likely using either display capture or game capture and i'm going to go ahead and tell you guys straight up there is no benefit from using either one like you're not going to get a performance boost for using game capture you're not going to get a performance boost for using display capture really the only difference in the two is display capture is going to capture every single thing on your screen so you guys can see anything i do on here my um d using display capture is going to capture every single thing on my display but if we swap over to game capture game capture lets you capture a specific window and then if you're playing a game you can come down here and specify which game you want it to capture um, and it'll basically capture that window and only that window so if you use if you pick if you're playing Valorant and you select it to capture your Valorant game window um, all it's going to capture is that Valorant game so if you go and want to open up something else on your monitor without people seeing it that's perfect because it's only going to capture Valorant now I personally use display capture because there's a lot of things that I'm looking at that I may want to show my viewers like if a meme if I'm looking at a meme on Twitter or something or if I'm watching a video with chat display capture is the one that you want to use if you are trying to if you're always showing your chat things on your screen and everything so personally I use display capture um, now you guys can always have both of them set up in here um, when you're playing a game have your display capture running and when you're not playing a game turn off game capture and turn on display capture it's really that easy but that pretty much sums it up for you guys um, for those of you that may have been wondering is it better to use game capture than display capture will I get some kind of a performance boost if I use display or game capture over display capture you won't get a performance boost on using either one it's really just all down to preference if you guys want your chat to see every single thing on your screen or if you want them to see only your game so I hope you guys enjoyed the video hopefully it was useful to you guys I got a lot more of these comments so again make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications if you guys have any topics you might want me to cover on any of these streamer blueprint videos make sure you drop a comment below um, I always look through the comments on these videos and a lot of them if they're good I actually turn those comments into actual videos for the stream or blueprint series so i'll catch you guys in the next one thank you for watching i hope you have a beautiful day peace